another episode of random 150 and we're talking about something easy today we're talking about selfies and not only the dawn of selfies and how many people are taking it and how it's become a part of the culture but more about people's opinions about it the selfies are one of those things that's that's hashtag t-e-h-o to each his own because uh, a lot of people bitch and moan about oh, too many people are taking selfies they make as if it's almost stupid to take selfies and to document your life and the stuff that you do but you know it's if if people feel the need to take a gazillion selfies on a daily basis and they want to load it whatever whatever it's it's their devices, it's their time that they're taking to take the pictures and it's their social media devices or their social media platforms that they're loading it on. The cool thing about social media and about life in general is that if you don't like something, you don't need to consume it. If you don't like selfies, if you don't... Same thing happens with football on, on social media. When there's a big match or something on, all the avid sports fans are obviously going to be talking about it and then you always get that one knob. It says, oh, it looks like they're playing sports again today. Oh, you big! Because I'm sure there's something that you're interested in that other people aren't interested in that you think is awesome that you will speak about, but it's your thing that you're into. So that's the thing. I just wish more people would just chill and that they would not try to force the, force the, uh, what they think is cool and what they think is not cool. Like a lot of people think mix it is dead just because it's not cool anymore. Mixit is not the fuck then. Mixit is one of the better social media platforms consumption wise in Southern Africa and in Africa. So just because you don't consume it, don't think and don't uh, perpetuate your opinion and your thoughts about it on other people, if you know what I'm saying. The game of the week is Robot Unicorn Attack 2, which is an epic side scroll of phantasmical proportions. You find yourself in a magical world where uh, the robot unicorn has many attacks, many power-ups, and you find yourself in front of your phone for hours on end. Make sure you check out some of my other videos that I've done uh, in recent times. There's uh, lots of randomness, lots of things to explore, and um, lots of things to keep you busy.